As a teenager, early 20s, I was a picture of health and could work out as hard and as much as I wanted and, and fitness was a huge part of my life. Then I uh, came to a point where I got diagnosed with multiple sclerosis. I didn't believe that I had MS until a few years later when I was working out really hard, I actually had a real symptom and then I believed that, okay, I've got MS. The Y gave me some place I could work out. My, my wife actually pulled me into it and was helping me realize, okay, you do need to be doing something. I'd say there is a degree of pride because when I've gone from you know, riding my bike a hundred miles or something, a full intense workout, and considering, okay, now that's a workout. Now I'm at the Y and my workout is 10 movements of a low light weight that my 15 year old or four, actually even when he's younger, he can do that. There was an adjustment there to say, okay, this is my workout now. And I had to, say, you know, that was my old workout, this is my new workout. I've got to do something, and as little as it feels, it's better than nothing. The, the transition was a difficult transition to say, okay, my goal of, say, the World Championships is, that's no longer a possibility. And it's hard for me because I've always been the shoot for the stars type of a person, so it's like, saying, okay, stop shooting for the stars, just shoot for the moon.